It's a little bit complicated because, uh, as you say, I'm a recovering alcoholic. I've definitely been through that. I'm very open about it. I don't, you know, and it's, it's, um, mo I mean, I'm open about it for one reason because my life is public and that's just the life I live. That's not a choice I made. Right. Whether um, you want but, it to be or not, right. it's so going to be, be out there. Discussed. So yeah. I feel like if that's going to be discussed, then I'm going to discuss it in an open way. And hopefully a byproduct of that is, as you suggest, that somebody might say like, well, if he can kind of like go through it or, or more specifically really kind of uh, demonstrate that you don't have to be defined by these issues. A lot of people struggle with whether it's addiction or compulsive behavior, shopping, gambling, porn, uh, sex addicts, drugs, opiates, alcohol. I mean, you can see uh, the, the tendrils of this thing kind of spread out. And <clears throat> I think the value, if there's value in me talking about being a recovering alcoholic, is that, you know, that doesn't have to be who you are. That's not, doesn't have to be the label on your head.